Good afternoon, and welcome to another ironic introduction to another video. Today, with the release of a 4-star rank up offer package and July 4th right around the corner, I wanted to talk about the very small demographic of players that I think should consider buying this deal. That if I was in that demographic, I would buy this deal. Now, for the majority of players, anybody who grinds the arena enough to have more than 5,000 units, anybody who is willing to spend any amount of money on this game should not buy this. Um, and uh, anybody who is at the point where five stars are phasing out their four stars, you know, maybe you have, I would say, four to five five stars or above. You know, you're slowly reaching that point where, you know, statistically speaking, you will get a five star and you can slowly phase out your four stars. Uh, I think that though this deal is not for you. Now, if you are in the demographic where you have met anywhere from zero to two five star champions and none of those five stars are like god tier champions, um, if you are someone who is not uncollected, someone in an alliance that is active, but not like top tier active. So, you know, maybe you're pushing somewhere between 300 to 500 glory every week um, from your alliance. Someone who is is gated by, you know, your four star roster and, you know, you're not expecting your five star roster to push you in the game anytime soon. And you have significantly less than 5,000 units but you know the 2250 units here so maybe you have 3000 units in your stash here um, you know you're not going to push up to 5000 and you know you're not going to spend money to top off this deal might be something you consider like if i was in your position i would actually buy this deal um, now if you are a person who has fomo or fear of missing out i would not buy this deal uh, just because the anxiety you're gonna have over the July 4th bundles and then when July 4th comes around the stress you're gonna have of like oh well what if this was the one time I had spent twenty dollars and I don't want to put anyone in that kind of a position so if you are someone who has FOMO do wait for July 4th no matter how potentially better this deal is potentially worse you don't want to have that anxiety just you know ignore this deal and you know keep your mindset on July 4th um, but that small pool of players for whom have the 2,250 units, but not the 5,000 units for the July 4th bundle, a small pool of players for whom four stars are still significantly better. What you are getting here, um, most notably, is this rank four to rank five and this rank three to rank four generic rank up gem. Now, this first one, this rank two to rank three for 500 units, this one's pretty much just a tax on the other ones. It is still valuable. All of these signature, signature stones, crypt champion boosts, those have value. Um, but, you know, all it really d is is, you know, subtracting from the total cost and total value. Because the th real thing, the real thing that pushes players to buy this is going to be this rank three to rank four gem, which is essentially three tier four basic catalysts uh, which is a hard time gate for a lot of players that I'm talking about uh, related to this video and this rank four to rank five gem now a rank four to rank five champion is five tier four basics and three tier four class catalysts as well as two two tier one alphas and so even though tier four basics are relatively accessible in this game over time just by like building up to an alliance that is more active you know if you can get you know and then pumping out the points in the arena for the tier four basics it's specifically the tier tier four class catalysts that are not accessible in this game especially for newer players like for the longest time i was able to push myself up to this rank four position as far as champions go and then i just had to sit here and look at the tier four class catalysts and say wow that's gonna take me a while i mean i got even as someone who grinds and wails in this game i got hard gated by this part of the game uh and so that those three tier four class catalysts for someone who's not uncollected and someone who isn't able to push high quantities of glory uh, this is actually really valuable and so when i look at this i want to say that there is that small demographic of players if you have a like rank four stark enhanced spider-man you have a rank four ghost omega red archangel you have one of those four star champions that is worth bringing to rank five you might consider this deal uh, i might i might even endorse it uh but you know there is that risk of FOMO and I don't want anybody to miss out because of my recommendation I just want you to know if I were in that position what I would do because I think that there is a pool of players that that consideration is important I don't want every deal to just be wait for July 4th because sometimes sometimes the deal is this deal is better like my brother uh, who just started playing this game 
if he had the 2,250 units for this deal, I would tell him to buy this deal over it. Now, I don't think this deal is worth putting money onto the game because if you're going to put money onto the game, wait for July 4th. Um, but this is specifically for people who have that number of units and won't reach the 5,000 marker. Um, I think this one has a lot of value. So that said, this video has gone on longer than it needs to. Um, if you want to talk to me, talk to me about it in the comments. Uh, we can discuss, you know, if you're thinking about buying this and you think I've hit your demographic, maybe we can talk about it more. We can go over the pros and cons for you. There's plenty of time on this. 24 hours is a reasonable amount of time. Don't let that 24 hour limit make you feel pressured. You've got plenty of time, even at the time of making this video. And I will talk to you all later.